ESP said, you think Diddy catching the case? All right, so we talk about Diddy real quick. So, do I got Diddy on the docket? I got to have Diddy on the docket. I got some videos. I don't know if I got the headlines. So, apparently, like, this nigga, he got another. Um, so, he got one. Him and his bodyguard got. He got one from his bodyguard last week. And it's not Gene Dill, the nigga that'd be on Art of Dialogue at the time. It's another bodyguard. And then he got a, another case from somebody. And then, so, hold up. What's the <clears throat> bodyguard showing about? Uh, I think it was sexual. I think it might have been sexual assault, too. Err. That's crazy. How you how you how you taking the booty of of your security? <laughs> I don't think he was like taking the nigga booty. I think he was like I think he was like making the nigga go like freaky parties and shit like that. Gotcha. Like he'll come in or like he'll be fucking a chick and he'll be like, Hey nigga, hold her hair. Nah, that's crazy. I made that up, but that's not something Diddy would do. Yes. But like, hold my leg up. Hey, Pour me champagne. <laughs> you know what's crazy? Nobody brings this up, but nobody, everybody forgot. Diddy caught a caught like a, a um a um um sexual assault allegation like two years, like a year or two ago from his old cook. Like she said, that nigga was like making her like make meals for him after he had sex. And That's like, crazy. And like a couple of situations, like he'll come in the kitchen butt ass naked and made and like I think he called her. He made. He had some shit where like he was making her make sandwiches after he made had sex. That's crazy. And she and that was like two years ago. Nobody brings that up. I ain't know you could get sued for that. I mean, I will say this: sexual harassment, nigga. Hold on, hold on, hold on. No, 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 no. I'm I'm not talking about when he was naked, but I'm talking about just after you have sex. Look, if I'm paying you, let's say, let's say, let's say I'm paying fifty thousand dollars a year for a chef, right? Mm-hmm. Personal chef. Yeah. And that's like, I'm assuming that's your salary, but your your, your living situation I'm taking care of too, if you're my personal chef. Type Most chef, chef works um, part-time anyway. Okay, well, yeah, yeah. All right, we'll bet 50000 a year part-time. All right. So, I'm expecting to be able <laughs> to say, does she live there? I don't know, nigga. I just know the nigga was a freak. Okay, okay, okay. Well, if she lives there and it's not crazy hours, I'm not waking her up out of her sleep type shit. As long as I'm fully clothed, I'm presentable. Mm. I'm expecting I can get a meal after I have got through pounding some ass. Okay, that's, that's, it's, that sounds crazy, but okay. If I'm Let's, paying you to cook... Can I not say, I right, look, I, I just got through smashing, you know what I'm saying? Mm. And like now I walk, I, you know, again, fully clothed. I done showered. Yeah. Everything, you know what I'm saying? I'm cleaned up. He wasn't fully clothed. Right, 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 right. But if, if he were. Yeah. I'm only saying it to say, if you're presentable, I initially it came off like the premise of it was cooking after he's had sex now being that he was naked that's some disgusting shit this like, word that's it, that's this word this is where the issue like lies mm-hmm. so he presented it to her as you are cooking for me every time i have sex oh no 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 that's crazy yeah. That's crazy. Yeah, that's crazy. Now, if you just come, like, you just happen to have sex and you be like, hey, can you make me a meal then? Right, right, right. Yeah. But it's a known fact that he's in the other room fucking. And, and we got to be we, preparing And we come meal. out, when he come out that room, you better have his post-sex sandwich. Oh, that's crazy. Nah. That's, that's how it was. Yeah. It was like, I, when I come out this room and I'm done fucking, my food better be ready. Damn, and he, and he gonna come out butt naked. Nah, no, 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 no. I, I, I took. I, I missing. So, damn, and he gonna be in the kitchen with the shit swinging, eating the All sandwich. Right, whoa, that's whoa, whoa, whoa. All right, that's whoa. where sexual harassment comes. Whoa, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> nah, hey, did he, did he, did he? Did, if he don't got one coming, he might need one coming. What? Uh, what surviving did he? Uh, a case. Oh, you talking about like a, a criminal case? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Uh, I doubt that happened. Niggas just want. Yeah, he got too much money. I'm gonna be real. Yeah, nigga. Just like the whole Cassie shit when the people were like, "Oh man," because she did a straight civil case. Mm-hmm. Nigga, she went through she went through trauma. Nigga, yeah. get that reimbursement. Yeah. Fuck, fuck that nigga being what? What does the he been? What does him being in prison do for her? And she got trauma, right? No, nah, nigga, give me thirty. Cassie minutes. got kids. If I ain't mistaken, she married and shit now. So yeah, she got two. Yeah. Gotta take, she got a white man. She got to take care of that cracker. That's crazy. <laughs> so it's like, but the documentary, though, I don't know what this nigga, this nigga 50 Cent hate. This nigga 50 Cent hate this nigga, did he? So 50 Cent supposed to be doing a documentary. He said 50 documentary. 50 Cent says proceeds from his upcoming Diddy documentary will go towards sexual assault victims. <laughs> Uh, 50, you're a real nigga for that. Yeah, he is. Uh, he the biggest troll, but he do some of the realest shit. Yeah. Stan, what's happening, man? <laughs> yeah, what's good, Stan? And so it went from being like, oh, this nigga, nigga, he was like, he like, he like, uh, Diddy biggest troll, but it's like, it's coming to the light that this nigga 50 Cent really don't like this nigga. Mm-hmm. That he's, he using his own money to make a 50, I mean, uh, Diddy freaky nigga, Freako documentary. That's, like whack one hundred times. He said, "I'm funding this shit." <laughs> that nigga whack one thousand. <laughs> no, whack one hundred is a weirdo. No, he's this. Yeah, he should be. Nah, I respect Fifty. He he done been in the trenches. I'm pretty sure he done got asked. He he done said it. He said he done got asked to come to them parties. Yeah, 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 yeah. And and not <clears throat> just that. He is a filmmaker. Like he does a phenomenal productions. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Um, I, I, you know, could you call him a, a, a filmmaker? I'll say he's a film producer. You know what I mean? Like, hey, we got thirty five niggas, man. Let's get the, put them likes up. What you saying? Um, you know, he's got a good eye for content and like entertainment. I got to check out Raising Canaan. The boys in the Discord was telling me that uh, that 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 that, that shit fire. Raising Canes, they chicken is disgusting. I said raising Canaan, nigga. Raising Canaan? Yeah. Raising Canaan on Showtime. Yeah, the chicken. Oh, raising Canaan, the show. You know what? 